almost got bit by this handsome creature. This is Henry, he's a border collie, and we are bathing him in our dirty dog shampoo. Henry has always shown aggression for the blow dryer, so we use a muzzle and a happy hoodie, and he turns into a completely different dog. Henry is not normally aggressive for any other part of the groom, but today, while I was shaving out some matting, he spun to bite me, which was a surprise. So I use a muzzle and a groomer's helper to keep me safe. Henry was obviously in a mood today, and during the brush, he started to show some aggression, so him and I had some words. Inappropriate. After that, I clipped his nails, and then I shaved his paw pads and he was mean again. Then I trim the top of his paws, I spray him in our blueberry cologne, and he asks me for his forgiveness. Thank you for the challenge, Henry. At least you're going home looking beautiful. Every now and then, I groom live stuffed animals with a face of an angel and a mouth like a shark. This is Ginger. She's a one-year-old Shih Tzu, and she has a very full of poop attitude. This is Kane. He's a five-year-old Doberman Pinscher. We bathed him in our dirty dog shampoo, and then we blow-dried him with the high-velocity dryer. After that, we de-shed him using the Equi Groomer. This is his sister, Abby, and she is a two-year-old Doberman Pinscher. After her bath, we blow-dried her with the high-velocity dryer. This is the first time that I have ever worked on Dobermans. They were both extremely well-behaved and well-trained. Abby allowed us to dremel her nails. We don't usually use a dremel, but in this case, her nails were very long and we wanted to get them as short as possible. Kane unfortunately did not allow us to use the dremel. We brushed Abby with the Equi Groomer, sprayed them both down in our jelly bean cologne, and they are all finished, beautiful and shiny. It's the moment you've all been waiting for. This is Molly and she's an eight-year-old golden retriever. I'm bathing her today in our dirty dog shampoo and our de-shedding shampoo. Molly was given up by her previous owners when she was six years old because they said that she does not get along with their other dogs. But I don't believe that because Molly wouldn't hurt a fly. We're spraying her down with our 50-50 vinegar water mixture and then we're blow drying her with the high velocity dryer. Then I spray her down with the stuff for dogs and brush that through her coat with my Chris Christensen coral brush. Then I use my undercoat rake, my equi groomer, and my metal comb. Once she's brushed out, I shave her ears with my number seven, and then I trim up her Grinch feet. Then I shave out her paw pads, and I tidy up her body and her tail nice and neat. Then I spray her down in our sugar cookie cologne, and she's all done looking so beautiful. A lot of you have been begging me for a husky for quite some time. This is Callie, she's 12 years old, and we see her every three months for grooming. As you can see, her coat is very compacted and she's going to lose a lot of hair. I bathed her in our de-shedding shampoo and then I fully conditioned her body. I use my de-shedding nozzle to remove as much undercoat as possible while she's in the bathtub. And then after her bath, I spray her down in our vinegar water spray to speed up the drying process. And then I blow dry her with our high velocity dryer and she lost a whole lot more hair. Huskies don't usually like having their feet touched, but Callie is a very good dog. I clip her nails and then I shave out her paw pads. I brush her with our Chris Christensen coral brush and then I switch to the undercoat rake. I finish her off with my metal comb. She's so pretty. And then I spray her down in our blueberry cologne and Callie is all finished feeling fresh. This is the Wrecking Ball Hudson. He flies into my shop, knocking over anyone and anything in his path. But the second he gets into the bathtub, he turns into a statue. If you met Hudson, you would be hard-pressed to believe that he is this well-behaved for grooming. He is a young golden doodle, 
And before I dry him, I spray him down in our quick dry spray. Hudson knows he's fabulous and will only settle for top-notch spa treatment. I am taking his body down today in my number three blade. And I'm taking his head down in my five eight inch comb attachment. After that, I give him his manicure and then I shave out his paw pads. I turn them into perfectly sculpted fluffy clouds and this fine gentleman remains perfectly still as I trim out the corner of his eyes and round up his adorable face. I trim the ends of his ears and I spray him down in our exotic orchid cologne. And now Hudson is ready to bulldoze his way through my shop.